so so far we have seen student union library Millikan hall all those things so let's look at the other buildings which are right behind engineering okay. what you see over there is creole this is one of the most respected departments in ucf which holds a very good ranking in the whole of us for optics and then laser studies so just adjacent to it you can see harris engineering corporation engineering center uh, where most of the seminars conferences and uh, engineering activities and this is department the place acti where <coughs> activities will be held electrical and computer science uh, classes or the professors you can uh, you will be dealing with most of them there this is, is a, it's also known as engineering 3 engineering 3 yeah. right so that is the biomolecular uh, sciences. sciences let me focus on that yeah so that's the biomolecular science building we can just walk across look at the wheels it's just a pickup truck So, biomolecular biotechnology building. people, biomolecular sciences, all those things are in this building. This is your yeah. destination. Uh, you'll be coming to this for your uh, lab work or your uh, classes, whatever. Most of the times you'll be here only. And right just beside or in fact I should say behind to it is the new physics building which is being built. Um, I think most of the people who will be coming next time for the physics major will be residing out there because most of the professors or their labs will be definitely there. Today, uh, as of now, it's uh, in, in engineering only. Uh, there's a, sorry, there's a physics uh, aligned with math department, which we have. So as you can see, there are quite a lot of buildings here and you don't have any shortcomings in terms of resources or books or laboratories so it's quite equipped well equipped in most of the departments but uh, if you are thinking big then you must give a second thought to the whole process because as you can see there are there are limitations also there are big buildings there are small buildings big people small people every kind you can see and uh, that is the chemistry department you which you see the chemistry department there Right, left, next to it, that is on the left is the student health center, which you'll need to go as an incoming student for depositing your immunization or your health insurance, whatever it is, right on the left. Then, this is the, immediate to my right is the entrance of the business administration MBA. center, uh, which has classes in MBA. Some of the engineering guys, you might be having your classes in this hall as well. So the one building which you see over there, health center, that is the place where you need to register for your health insurance and if you don't register for your health insurance then you will not be allowed to take your classes. So it's very important that you finish the I-20 International Services Center uh, activities as well as health center activities before you begin anything concerned with the academics. The whole this campus is the theater. Is strewn with these maps. You can use this at any time for your disposal to look out where you are or if you are lost somewhere. You can use this, help out yourselves. <coughs> this is the theater on your right, which has, uh, which holds classes as well and uh, has some functions which are organized on a regular basis. On the immediate left is a chemistry building which is still going on. is the math and physics department. It's a combined department of math and physics, and out of which physics is being shifted now to a new building. Are you going inside? 